WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. Dow. Dow Industrial is down 129. NASDAQ off 193. S&P is off 44. You had a high volatility day out here, folks. It started low, went high, and came right back to the lows. Gold. Gold contract down $52.70, trading at 1878 an ounce. We had silver down at buck $21, $22.40 an ounce. Platinum is off $51, $980 an ounce. Light Sweet Crude down $261, $73.28 a barrel. Notes and bonds. A 10 year note traded down a full point plus four ticks at $114.12. 30 year down a full point plus 24 ticks at $130.02. And you had the 10 year right now, we're yielding 3.52. So we take a look at the last three months, the lows 3.3, the highs 4.2. We go to the last six months, and you're gonna see 2.6 is the low, 4.2 is the high, right where 3.5. And King Dollar, King Dollar got, finally got traction. This was on the jobs number, of course. Up 1,246 ticks, trading 102,996. <clears throat> the Euro is at 107. The yen is at 131, the British pound is at 120 to one US dollar. We can open and take a look at the uh, SPY first. What you're gonna see out here, folks, is that you closed at uh, 212.35, and you put this on a weekly, you're gonna see that bottom line came up to the swing. The swing there had 545 million shares. Well, we, we closed over it, and you only did 446. So when you close over it, it's saying, yeah, you can go higher. There's no doubt about that. Um, and we'll see how that shakes out. Because, you know, be back down, but that's what, when you, get a, when you get a high swing and the volume was decent, that can get back up there. My take is it's not going to, but that doesn't matter. <laughs> what matters technically, it can get back up there. We got to take a look at the NDX 100, the three Qs. Bottom line is that you get over the last swing. You actually, the swing you're dealing with in the three Qs has 325 million. That swing, and this with the, let's see, 325 versus 326. I love it, man. So it's not a failure in price and volume, it's a failure on price because we went over the swing with 1 million more. Bottom line, folks, get some sleep over the weekend because you're going to continue to have high volatility next week. Great trade market. Have a great weekend, safe weekend. Come back and visit Tommy Monday morning, 9 o'clock. Look at him, folks.